A new license, a ride with dad, and suddenly, tragedy. Good evening, I'm Yanji Denise. And I'm Paula Akana. In the middle of spring break week, a teenage girl crashed and died during a scooter ride with her father. KITV4's Paul Drews reports on this deadly accident. Speed is a factor in this collision. It's a mistake many drivers make, picking up speed on this on-ramp from the Leaky Leaky Highway to the H3 Freeway, even though it's a 180-degree turn and the speed limit's 25. Today, it was a teenager out riding motor scooters with her father with tragic results. The daughter who was the lead vehicle lost control and struck the guardrail. She was taken to the Queens Medical Center in critical condition where she expired. The teenager had been wearing a helmet, but it was not enough to protect her in this crash. This fatal accident is just the latest deadly crash to take place along this curving on-ramp of the Leaky Leaky Highway. Last August, a more experienced rider, a member of the motorcycle group known as Iron Circle Hawaii, died when his bike slammed into the same guardrail. A witness said they saw the motorcyclist lock up his rear tire, and police believe he too was speeding up the on-ramp. Just like the last fatal accident, the latest deadly crash closed the on-ramp for hours while police pieced together exactly what happened. The on-ramp reopened just before 11 this morning. In Kaneohe, Paul Drews, KITV4 News.